Yeah. No, nah, he's a cracker. <clears throat> Beautiful. Well, welcome to another episode. Decided to do something slightly different today. Not going to chase the elephant whiting. I'm um, going to go try some garfish. I've uh, got the bait and the burley. Funny thing on the bait side of things, got down here and guess what? I've got the, uh, the maggots. So I had to stop into the uh, local tackle shop, grab a pack. But apart from that, it's been smooth sailing so far. But let's get out there and give it a shot. All right, so pretty basic setup. You've got the uh, float, burley cage, two hooks, one below, one below, the, sorry, one below, one above the uh, cage. So uh, let's get out there and see what happens. Well, I've already seen boils on top of the water right next to the float, so that's a very, very good sign. Oop, had a bite. So there's fish there. Yep, got one. No, dropped him. <laughs> All right, recast because there's definitely fish there. Yep, yeah, bait and everything looks all right. Ooh, more bites. him again. There's only plenty of fish there. So oh, can't hook him. Oh, hook that one. Feels more like a Tommy, is it? Don't know what it is. I think it dragged me through the weed though. Oh, double header of uh, no good fish. <laughs> one spat the hook, which is good. The old trumpeter. <laughs> Funny things they are. Alright, well let's get the uh, baits sorted out and back out there again. Alright, so we're back out there again. Have seen a little garfish. There's actually garfish right here in front of me. Wow. They're not the bigger ones, but lots of gar. I don't know if you can see all that splashing, but there's a lot of little mullet mixed in with it as well. Very good signs. Hopefully we'll get a couple of garfish for a feed. Sometimes just a little bit of movement to get the garfish to bite as well. Yep, we definitely hooked one. Feels like a garfish. No, I don't think it is. No, another trumpeter. <laughs> oh, get that sorted out. All right, another hook up. This feels a bit better. So you what, it's been action packed as soon as I got here. What do we got? Just don't tell me it's another trumpeter. No, Tommy. That's all right, I'll take it, Tommy. Well, he swallowed that one right down. He's not going anywhere. So we'll dispatch him, pop him in the bag. All right, looks like we picked up another little Tommy. No, nope, we dropped him. <laughs> oh, you gotta love Tommies for that. Well, there's definitely no shortage of fish here at the moment. So I haven't been able to manage, or well, haven't managed to land targeted species. Well, we'll keep trying.
definitely see a lot of garfish out there. But we'll be able to catch them when they're hungry enough. Or they've been overfed over the weekend. Well, I have no idea what I've hooked here, but it's definitely got a bit of pull in it. <laughs> Looks like it got, what, yellowfin whining stuck up the bum? Or is it a decent mullet? No, it's a decent mullet. Just hooked him in the back. Well, that's a de <laughs> definitely worthwhile catching him size that. Definitely worthwhile catching him that size, that's for sure. Come on, in you come. Oh, that's good size. Now, catching mullet that size is definitely worthwhile. Look at that. Beautiful. Get a few of those, I'll be happy. Alright, so we've got our first one of the target species. Not exactly a huge fish. Come here, bugger. There we go. Oh, missed him. There you go. Nice little garfish. Off he goes. Yep, get myself sorted out now. Alright, hopefully we've hooked a decent size one this time. Yeah, she looks a bit bigger than the last one. Beautiful. Oh, and we lost him. <laughs> Isn't that just fishing? Right, well, I think we've got, think we've got a Tommy on here. Yeah, another little Tommy. Beautiful. I'll take that. Not a bad side Tommy either. Oh, excellent. Again, looks like a garfish this time. Let's see if we can land it. <laughs> yeah, he's not too bad. Keep that one. There we go. Lovely. Ooh, I think we hooked another Tommy. Oh, we lost him. Ah. Oh, I hooked another one. Let's see, uh, yeah, she should be size. Yep, that size. Beautiful. There we go. Lovely fish. We'll dispatch him and pop him in the uh, catch bag. Alright, another fish. Feels a little bit better, actually. Yeah, nah, he's a cracker. <clears throat> Beautiful. Nice chunky fish. Well, unfortunately, I didn't get to do a conclusion to this video. Uh, main reason why is because I got called away. Uh, my daughter, she had a uh, gastro bug that she caught from school. There's been one going around. Uh, what happened was she just ended up vomiting absolutely everywhere in the classroom. Obviously, they had to get cleaned up. She needed to go home. So had to get home and look after sick girls and as you know with any type of gastro bug it went through the whole family, all the girls got it, I was the last one to get it so in total I was probably out of action for well over a week um, but hey that's life, that's what happens. Now the reason why I was dropping a lot of fish uh, in that video is because I wasn't using fresh hooks, um, I was using old hooks and they're nowhere near as sharp as the ones you get straight out of a packet. So a good practice is to make sure that you've got fresh hooks every single time you go fishing. Um, you'll, you'll find that your success rate definitely increases. Um, apart from that, I also was mucking around with a few, with a few settings um, on the video side of things. And I don't quite like the quality that's come out, so I won't be using those settings again. Uh, but the good thing is, now that I've uh, mucked around with it, I know that I'm not going to use it again. And I'm pretty sure that the next few videos afterwards will be good videos. Um, as always, if you like the content, like and subscribe. Um, if there's anything that you want to see or know, leave a comment down below. Um, but as always, have a good one.